As a black man, being able to create something that's so successful, that's enjoyed by many different people, many different backgrounds, it's quite a phenomenal feeling, I must say, the work that we put into creating fluffy snowballs. Everyone enjoys it. I created Fluffy Snowballs because, first of all, I moved here in 2005 as a result of Hurricane Katrina. I had just finished undergraduate studies from the illustrious Tuskegee University. I graduated that spring, moved home that summer. That Friday I moved home, Hurricane Katrina happened that Sunday. I lost everything. I got to Venice Beach, I was hot, I was depressed, and I wanted a snowball. So I said to myself, I was like, you know what, somebody needs to make this, and I think I'm gonna do it. The overall mission of Fluffy Snowball is to build community. And I find Fluffy Snowball special, one, because it is authentic. Like Kev said, he is New Orleans through and through. There is nothing fake about this. You know, he was born and red in New Orleans, and that's why he gives everything he comes to the snowballs. When you walk into this environment of Fluffy Snowballs, you will get New Orleans, you'll get the sight, the sound, the smell, the taste of New Orleans, but more than anything else, you will get that authenticity of New Orleans. And a part of our mission is to create a product that is delicious, that is made of high quality ingredients, and that wraps you up with that Southern hospitality of the South. So you guys are probably thinking, what is a snowball? Snowballs permeate the culture of New Orleans. They are everywhere. Our snowballs here at Fluffy Snowballs, the ice texture is identical to snow versus a snow cone where you have ice texture that's very coarse, rocky, and crunchy. Then the quality of our syrup. So I make all 72 of our flavors. Each one has its own distinct recipe. Whereas with a snow cone, you get that kind of watered down, a hint of flavor, and the syrup just kind of goes to the bottom and you're left with a really hard ball of ice. Whereas with a snowball, the syrup is infused inside of the ice. And when I tell you, come to Fluffy Snowballs, it like sends your senses and it just tantalizes your senses. Here at Fluffy Snowballs, it is our goal to appeal to all five senses. From the moment you get out of your car, you're gonna hear that New Orleans second line music blasting. I listen to some really cool jazz music by John Coltrane or the great Louis Armstrong. When you come to Fluffy Snowball, if you want something tart, I got you. We might wrap that dill pickle with some leeking mui, some polar punch on the side, maybe some pineapple, but trust me, dill pickle will blow your mind. I would say as an entrepreneur, for me, the most struggling part was actually having faith, to be quite honest with you. So Kev is more of the individual that runs Fluffy Snowball, and I always give him credit for that. I always tell people that Fluffy Snowball wouldn't exist if it wasn't for Kevin. Yes, I'm his, his husband, I support him 110%, but I give it to him when it comes to Fluffy Snowball. He has faith. <laughs> He believes in this product. He believes in building this company. I've accomplished some things that I was told I would never accomplish, quite honestly. I've been through the trenches. I've lost a lot, but I've also gained so much in the process. And I was told so many times that I would never be anything. I was told so many times that I'm supposed to fail. I'm not supposed to be where, I am, where I'm at today between being a homeowner being a husband to an amazing individual, having a business, and being educated, I was told I was not supposed to have those things. So I want other black people to see that it is possible. You could look like me, and you can actually make it happen as well too. When you have people telling you that you're not worth it, that you're not gonna get there, don't let nobody stop you. It is absolutely possible, and I think telling my story will actually encourage other black boys that look like me to deal with the same struggles that I've dealt with, to understand that it is possible and don't let nothing stop you. Life for me has not been a crystal stair, but the moment that I embraced my faith, embraced who I was, and you know, in the words of Baldwin, go the way that your blood boils, life began to change and things began to unfold. And what we did was we both set our minds out and was very intentional about the life we wanted to create. So what I say to all the people out there is that you have to be intentional about the life you want to create, the life you want to live. There's this book called The Alchemist. You just got to figure out what it is you want to do and you got to go out and just do it. But it all starts with you trying to figure out what that thing is. So sometimes you got to be still in order for it to come to your mind. What I'm most proud of about Fluffy Snowballs is the fact that we have created a company not even three years old that have been rated by Yelp, which is one of the leading review arbitrators, as the number one shaved ice cream company in the state of California and number five in the entire nation. Not only that, Fluffy Snowballs have empowered so many youth to take on greater opportunity, have reached out to so many communities and partnered with so many other nonprofits and businesses. You're probably wondering, what's our secret to success? I'll be very frank with you. Our secret to success is service, sincerity, authenticity, and quality. 
Some words of advice I would share with other black entrepreneurs that want to start their own businesses. First of all, be patient. Be extremely patient and understand that it's not going to happen overnight, but it will happen. Be consistent. You have to be consistent. So what do you guys can expect from Fluffy Snowballs in the future? Guys, guess what? We will be opening up our second location in Los Angeles. We are literally going to be at 2105 West Century Boulevard, which is literally one mile from the SoFi Stadium and the new Clippers Stadium. So I'm looking forward to you guys coming. We will have our Fluffy Snowballs Long Beach location that will remain open, but we'll be opening up our second location corporate store in the city of Long Beach. I want you guys to come on out because it's time that we're going to uh, ready to give LA all that Fluffy Snowballs have to give.